waste rock. Bring it over here. We really gotta figure out some use for all this waste rock. I know I keep saying that, but like, it doesn't stop being extremely true. There's so much stuff back there. That's a problem. Ooh, we're done with CO2 jet propulsion. So that means if we go to infrastructure, can we get a shuttle hub? That's not so bad. Mortal Engines. Another colony has announced some insane theory about mobile colonies and city Darwinism. The Colony of Paradox Interactive plans to build a giant mobile colony which would slowly crawl towards resource sites, harvest them, move forward when they're depleted. Even crazier, they expect that others will follow their example and in time, bigger colonies would assimilate the smaller ones. One thing is certain, such an ambitious goal cannot be accomplished in the next few hundred years. <laughs> if if you're playing all if you're also playing as paradox interactive you can also do don't worry we're secretly working on such a project already uh let's see so gain hippies or i don't really know which one i just picked i think i clicked on it I'm not sure. Lose the hippies. But the hippies are happier. I have a lot of parks. I'm actually a little disappointed you can't do that in this game. To be totally honest with you. Service buildings are full. Relaxation. Can I, can I get some parks up? Is the park? Wow, the park is full. Damn. Okay, well. What other techs have we picked up here? Maximum number of shuttles the shuttle, shuttle hub can house is up by six. Ah. Launch space mirror. Improves temperature. Launch magnetic shield. Decreases loss of atmosphere. Tourists pay more funding to come to Mars. Probably increase shuttle speed? Question mark? I'm just kind of doing whatever. Let's see, do I choose the people's food? No. Actually, you know who chooses the people's food? Currently, Paradox Interactive. I am trading concrete for food. Do I have enough? Enough for one. How much money do I have? Not enough. Capture ice asteroids. The capturing of ice asteroids has been successfully completed. With the use of special craft, we pursued and deflected the asteroids off their trajectory with nothing more than slight bumps. Thus, we've managed to gracefully steer large amounts of soon to be easily accessible water towards the surface of Mars. In this game of space billiard, though, there's always a chance the ball will hit the wrong pocket. Be ready to deal with the Mars quake. Okay, so we can do that again. We just got funding, that's good. Okay. I'm gonna call down another cargo rocket, almost entirely just with polymers and seeds. We're so close. I can almost switch up to grass. And then once we're at grass, then I can actually start doing some other things. Maybe. Might also want to increase the amount. 
of terraforming machines. Huh. <sighs> The main problem is mostly just... Because yeah, they have, like, next to no maintenance. A decent chunk of money. Let's see, the grass makes it look so nice. I... Oh. Yeah, I haven't even had grass. I'm personally actually pretty partial to this lichen. It it looks quite nice. So this one can carry rare minerals. Oh. That is a bad leak. Luckily, I've got storage for days. Okay, there we go. Okay, so seeds required minimum soil quantity quality. Okay, so that should work for all of them, yeah? Yeah. So we got grass. Okay, so it improves local soil quantity. It doesn't seem to really increase the amount of... Uh, it, it doesn't seem to be increasing the speed as fast as I'd like. But that's okay. Uh, let's see, so we want to build domes passage. Hi. Missing drinking, shopping, medical checks, dining, gambling, social. Probably fill out that mega mall. They're comfortable. Morale's still a little low. That's normal. When you get bushes, you'll start getting seeds from the plants, and soil quality does help lichen grow. It's just a bit obtuse. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. Let's get gravity engineering for a little while. Let's see. That might be, be better. I really wish you could actually, like, reorganize these things a little bit. Be nice. Okay. So what else do we got? Low resources. Are you still making that ramp? You are still making that ramp. Outside drone commander range. Hasn't broken down yet. I guess I'll bring an RC commander down this direction. And our shuttle load is pretty bad. Well, do we make two more? I'll make two more. Oh, am I done, uh... Not quite done scanning things. How you doing? You're doing okay. Okay, so build... 
Homes and education. So we want to do apartments, apartments, apartments. Probably immediately go into just grabbing another Mega Mall. They're a little expensive on the polymers. Oh. We need to get another Moxie. Do we have anything else that produces oxygen? Ah, forest greenhouse. Question is, is there a reason not to? Nope. These things are awesome. Oh, I see. I'll just have it hug the drone depot. Because yeah, it produces four oxygen just on its own. Okay. Anything else that I immediately or intensely need to work on? We could use maybe more people. The real question is how many geniuses do we have? We got one genius. I could bring in some people. Let's see. It is a s senior genius. The rest of these look okay. And I should have space for all these people. Yeah, I wanted to mostly do purist. See, that's an engineer. I wanted to do mostly purist. Do we get another Martian University? Might make sense. It seems like we need one. A little pricey, but the work workforce bonus is absolutely worthwhile. Looks like we might still need another shuttle thing. What is this? Okay, how much does it cost to make a another shuttle hub? It's a little pricey. But that's not that big of a deal. Can I? Really hoping I could just squeeze this in in really odd spots. I guess I could squeeze it in right there. Not a terrible location. And we did just get another uh, set of fundings. So let's bring in cargo. Rocket can carry a shit ton of things. I love it. Okay, so our metal situation is not a problem anymore. That was a little bit of a concern for like a bit. Hmm. Hoping some grass would have started to pop up at this point, but I'm not. I'm not seeing it. Oh, well, that would be unfortunate. Yeah, that nighttime power drain is a little bit of a spook, but it's not actually a big deal. Let's see. Are these straight up just... Is this just not working? Nobody's working here. I guess I'll just turn it off, because, like, why even bother? Okay, let's get another cemetery. Another large garden. Got a new anomaly, bunch of stuff. How are we doing on food? 
Doing okay on food. Actually not doing so great on concrete. Three of those down. Now that'll cost me a fair bit of polymer, but it's okay. We'll be getting more. Oh, good. These guys are actually working pretty dang well now. Yeah, so the, the Martian universities are absolutely worthwhile. I'm running low on electronics, but that's fine. Should be fine, unless stuff breaks, like, right now. I don't need that. That's probably okay. What are you doing? Eh, not doing great on the uh, rare minerals. We'll want to grab some more at some point. So you got the Dreamer's Event Chain, right? Yeah. If I wanted to build, uh, let's see, another drone hub. Go back to this. Land you there. Just gonna let that go for a little while. Move that over there. Okay. You can tell which ones are inside the uh, the radius here. Which ones are not. This is really helpful, though. I'm glad we picked it up. That's you encouraging the dreamers, I hope. Oh, absolutely. I wasn't going to... I wasn't going to just squash that. That'd be boring. Wow, we have a lot of gamblers. Alcoholics and people with chronic conditions. Honestly, we should probably turn this on. My power situation isn't an issue, so we should have this running all night. Still having a lot of problems with just basic workers. Unemployed and homeless. Oh. She's not actually unemployed or homeless. That was a very temporary deal. Yeah, I've still got uh, 45 job openings. At this point, pretty much anybody that is... Oh, we do actually have a tourist. Funny. I guess that's one thing I could, could do, actually. A water con conservation. Yeah! Okay, so that drastically reduces the water costs. Which means I can make another lake and not have to worry about things. One of those. Okay, so let's let's get another passenger rocket. Uh, let's see. Filter. Clear all of these. We want... Uh, let's see. We want to go back. We want to do specialization. Is it a perk? Or no, it's a quirk. Tourists. Might as well take... Oh. Not all of these are tourists. 
Only the first seven. Okay, everybody else is just kind of... Whomever. Let's see, so let's get rid of her. Okay, might as well grab Clark Kent. Let's see. Whoops. Guess let's get rid of uh, Duke. Okay, and launch. So a bunch of tourists, but that's okay. Might as well grab some extra money while we're here. I almost kind of wish you could set up like a, a tourist chain that every time you have 12 tourists, the rocket will come and then leave. Probably also buy like a boatload of drones at some point. And yes, we did just pick up Clark Kent. I might want to make another one of these. Eh, it should be okay. Maybe not, actually. We'll get another fuel refinery. Ugh. Okay. So one way or another, we could probably get another lake. I think it's about time. Uh, let's see. Terraforming. Lake. Huge lake. That should work. Somehow that's not going to inter interfere with this. I have no idea how it's not. It's just not. And I don't know why. Okay, so we want to extend power cables. We're gonna just make a giant circuit like that. Are you good? Yeah, you're good. We go back into this drone hub. Because this will let me start going out here for some of the other resources. I'd like to, ooh, very high grade rare resource storage. That seems worth it. See, why don't you haven't gotten the 24 man rockets yet? Ouch. I actually, I'm growing this real slow. Like my, my design, my design, my, my plan here. Is to more or less just max out. Missing service medical checks. Yeah, we probably don't have nearly enough infirmaries at this point. We randomly have one of these. Ooh, meteor swarm coming. Am I good on resources? I could be better. Unfortunately, my fuel problem locks me in a little bit. And one more electronics factory would do the trick. Probably. People are working at this one. Hard to say. Okay, insufficient fuel. I think the main problem is I keep refueling rockets, which is an issue. Okay. Oh.
Let's see. Alcoholic. A workaholic. I'm going to switch from chronic condition to just auto. Because we might as... Now that we've gotten rid of, rid of the really, like, bad problems... I'll just do what I can. Holy crap, that's not the lake I thought it was going to be getting. But you know what? That's fine. Okay, life support pipes. Auto might get rid of dreamers. I don't think it will. But yeah, that's a good point. How did a mountain get into your huge lake? Not a clue. Okay, hopefully this won't cut into my water demand too much. If it does, I can always produce more. Let's get another moisture evaporator. Or several. Okay. I'm just going to leave that there for the time being, instead of constantly just cycling ships in and out. Okay, meteor storm's rolling in, and it's a big one. And yeah, I have no defensive towers. Mild concern, actually. Okay. I'm going to turn that off for the time being. Is my water level going to go up or down? It's still going down. Whether, whether that's on or not. Oh. Oh, that's why my water problem just got bad. Well, that's kind of miserable timing, but that's okay. You can go find another uh, water deposit pretty easily. That one's got average yield. Okay. Okay, so we want to build another drone hub. We might need a couple of drone hubs. Okay, so in that case, I got to turn off this lake whether whether I'd like to or not. Let's see, split power grid. Why? Oh, this? I mean, this whole thing doesn't even need to be here anymore. Nice part is, that actually gives me a lot more space. Admittedly, I'm going to have to flatten it all out, but that's okay. Really? <laughs> These tiny little nibs just right there and it's just like, yeah, I guess they didn't get salvaged for whatever reason.
Okay. So these are also done. This is metal. Well, on the plus side, this does mean I get to start moving my stuff out. On the negative side, this does mean I... It's bad timing. Let's see. Remember that the ground was elevated in that area before Wander terraformed it. Yeah, I uh, flattened everything. Let's see. Well, we're not in a state of panic yet. Not that didn't hit me. Okay, metals production is currently bad. But we do have a second metal underground metals right there. What about this? Underground metals, and that's going to run out soon. Got more metals up there. Eventually, I can move move on to the deep metals, but I don't know how to service that yet. 